With five military bases in the state, the armed forces is a big part of the Oklahoma way of life. So Governor Stitt and the legislature set out to improve the way the state serves its veterans and military personnel. You talk the talk, but this is actually an example of walking the walk. You know, we all recognize our, we say we recognize our veterans, you know, we, we give them the greetings and all, but this actually shows you what they're doing. It's not just lip service to our veterans, it's taking care of them, and it's taking care of them every day. On a sunny, brisk morning in Lawton, Fort Sill, Governor Sitt and lawmakers came together with the community to celebrate new laws on the books that make Oklahoma an even better place for veterans to live. We want to make sure that when people get out of the, uh, of the military after serving our country and our state, uh, that they stay right here at home in Oklahoma. A ceremonial bill signing for five pieces of legislation, an income tax exemption on military retirement benefits, two sales tax exemptions, a guarantee that every Oklahoma veteran gets a dignified burial after they pass, regardless of whether they can afford it or not, and a law allowing members of the state retirement system to purchase five years of military service credit. So this is probably one of the most aggressive legislative sessions that I've seen, frankly, uh, in dealing with these issues and helping these veterans out in, in their communities and where they want to be. This is a prime example of why I actually stayed here in the city of Lawton when I, when I retired from the service. This all is on top of legislation. The governor held a ceremonial signing for back in June at the Stephen A. Cohen Military Family Clinic at Red Rock in Lawton to celebrate increased funding and resources for veterans and their families. We want to make sure that we're the most uh, we're the most pro-military state in the country. I'm very thankful that our governor and, and our legislators um, put partisan politics aside to make um, this happened for our veteran community um, because it's not it's not what you say it's what you do for more information on how this new legislation may apply to you or to find other veteran services you can visit their website oklahoma.gov veterans and for more top 10 news like this story subscribe to the governor's youtube page and check out the top 10 news playlist